Hello and welcome to DFW Chefs Focus on the Food. Today we will be discussing how to mince garlic. So here we have some garlic bulbs that we pulled apart from the bunch there. And so first thing you want to do is go ahead and just take this and peel all this outer side off here. Okay, so once you have peeled it away, you'll see that you, you know, have got all the outer skin off there. So we'll just go ahead and peel the rest of our garlic and then I'll show you how to mince it. Alright, so once we have peeled our cloves of garlic here, we can just simply take our chef's knife here, lay it down, be very careful, and just hit it with the back of that, and this helps to smash down the cloves of garlic, which will make it easier to will which will make it easier to mince. So we can smash it down further. Smash it down. And smash it down. And when you do that, of course, don't forget that that edge is sharp. You don't want to go and cut your hand off. So, we we'll just go ahead and we just keep chopping and chopping and chopping. And then we chop it some more. And just when you think you're about done chopping, you keep on chopping some more. It helps when you, you know, pile the garlic up there and then you chop through it one way in one direction, chop through it in another direction. And it's going to get stuck on your knife. There's just no way around it. So you push it off of the knife. When you are done mincing your garlic, it should be very fine. You shouldn't have any big chunks in there. You definitely don't want to have anything, say, like that. It's way too big. That's not minced, that's chopped. You want it to be minced. You want it to be real small, real fine. It will start to stick together. All the little pieces, they just stick together. So, you know, it's a wonderful thing to know how to do. Minced garlic. Garlic is such a wonderful flavor. Definitely, you know, makes your food so much better. So good. Such a wonderful thing. Thanks again for joining us with another episode of DFW Chefs. Focus on the food. I truly appreciate your continued support. Thank you.